This week in Trade Archery 101, we're going to talk about the wrist, what is straight, what isn't straight, and why it's important. Welcome to Trade Archery 101. Greg here. All right, the wrist. Look, we all know to keep it straight. They all tell you to take it straight. And they all tell you it's important to draw from your back, right? You got to draw using your back. Don't use your arm. Don't use your arm. Draw from your back. Well, the two are connected, believe it or not. And what I found, people think this is a straight wrist. That's not a straight wrist. Actually, this is. Right? That's not. This is. Right? And when I see people draw, myself included, I like to draw, get my bow here and try to demonstrate it to you real quick. We want, many of us want that hand right up against our face. But look at my elbow. It's bent inward, and you're not going to get proper back tension with that cocked elbow. So like when I said, we want to draw, I want that hand right in there, man. I want to bury that hand in my face, right? That's not straight. That's straight. So in reality, what I want to do is I cock my wrist. I'm not going to pull my elbow back so much, which I'm going to do, but think about swinging this arm over and around in like that motion. It's a lever, right? Pivot point is here, rotates here, it pivots around the shoulder and comes into there. So I'm here, cock my wrist, right? I'm here, cock my wrist slightly out, cock my wrist slightly out. Now pivot on the shoulder, Roll it around and in place. And look at the, it's away from my face. All right. Sorry about the bad camera work, but just me. It's all I have in life. Well, sort of. But it's a big one. I found when I go like this, my arrows are pushed for me to the right. So if you're right, you'd be pushed to the left. So if you're out there and you're shooting, you notice all of a sudden you start shooting to the right? See if this is right. Um, this normally only happens to me when I've been shooting for a while. You know, once again, that mental tiredness kick, kicks in. You don't pay as much attention. You take things for granted. And your body's looking for shortcuts because it knows your tiredness, trying to conserve energy. All right, so I, when I draw, I'll set my shoulders. Cock my wrist up. I'm going to keep my, my forearm. Can't bend. I'm going to keep this angle, but the wrist is going to naturally come into place. So it comes in and out. Real simple. So if you're getting tired and you start shooting off the side, check your wrist angle. Maybe you got it cocked in. When you got it cocked in, you're pulling the wrong way. You're pulling this way instead of that way. All right. Quick tip. I hope it helps you. Uh, don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you next time with an all-new episode of Trad Archery 101.